Hi everyone, so it's been a long time and uh, I'm sorry about that, but this video is going to be a demo of a few products that I got. Last month, I know this video is so old, last month I went to the Arizona Natural Hair Expo, formerly known as the International Hair Natural Hair Meetup Day, but I taught a class on allergies and natural hair. I got to meet one of my subscribers. Hey, kitten cutie. It was really cool to meet her. I should have, we should have taken a picture together. Sorry about that. But anyway, she lives here in the valley, so we got together and she came to my class and it was a lot of fun. But I got a ton of products in this little like VIP bag because I taught this class at the expo and I decided to dive in and start reviewing some of the products. One product line that I can review is from Lotta Body and they gave me the Shape Me Custard Jelly the Moisturize Me Curl and Style Milk, and the Wrap Me Foaming Mousse. This video is going to be a demo on these two products. Um, I don't really wrap my hair that often, and I didn't, I, I couldn't figure out how to use all three products together, so I just did a review on this. So, if you want to see what I did with my hair, I did a wash and go, my old standby. Um, and if you want to see more of my review, then just stay tuned. Alright, 
So review time. Starting with the Moisturize Me Curl and Style Milk. I really like the way it smells. It's kind of like, almost like candy. If you like sweet candy smells, this is, that's what this kind of smells like. The Moisturize Me Curl and Style Milk says it defines curls, tames frizz, adds moisture and brilliant shine, and it's for relaxed and natural hair. First ingredient is water. So I don't know how it would work with uh, straight hair. Um, I never tried, I never used this product when I was relaxed or when I was transitioning. So I don't actually know how it will react to um, wearing straight styles. But it says on the back that you apply it to damp hair, tamp, towel dried or dry hair, distribute evenly through with fingers from roots to ends and style out of as desired. I applied it to more wet, less damp, but it wasn't like dripping wet. Well, maybe kind of, but it wasn't like sopping, dripping wet. It was just, it just, I wouldn't consider my hair damp when I put it in. And I was very heavy handed as you saw in the video. It says here that it defines curls, smooths and protects, hydrates and adds natural movement, um, detangles conditions and controls curls while adding brilliant shine, body and bounce. I did not detangle my hair with this product. By the time I was done washing and deep conditioning my hair, my hair was fully detangled. So I don't really know what the slip is like in this product, but I try not to detangle my hair when I'm about to style it in a wash and go because that kind of disrupts the curl pattern. And I kind of want to keep the curls defined as they are. And um, I think it did a good job with defining my curls. Um, smoothing, I don't, I don't know if it really smoothed my hair because I still have some frizz, you can kind of see it. Um, but that's inevitable with having curly hair. Um, I think it was very shiny and it says non flaking. This is where we get into a couple issues that I have. I was trying to show you in the demo how I was getting flaking and like beating up of product and I didn't understand. You know, I started with this and then I put the custard jelly on it and it was like beating up, like it was about to start flaking. That was not making me happy. I don't even know if it showed, shows up very well on camera, but that's what that was about. Um, so I guess in terms of what I use this product again, I think I would, I think I would use it again. Um, it was very moisturizing and it, it's a thicker consistency. It's not like super thick, not super thick, but, um, thick enough. I like the smell. This is a eight ounce bottle. I'm not exactly sure how much this costs, um, because I got it for free in the VIP pee kit since I taught the class at the expo. Um, but I want to say it runs about $5, maybe $6. And that's pretty inexpensive for uh, a moisturizer, but I think I could get a lot of use out of this product. Um, I'll put the ingredients in the description box below. So be sure to put all, um, to read the description box for all the details. But second product that I used was the Shape Me Curl Custard Jelly or Gelee. And this says lasting, long lasting hold, tames frizz and adds moisture for relaxed and natural hair. And this is a seven ounce jar. And you saw the consistency. It's not very watery, which was good because I was so afraid I was gonna like tip it over and it was gonna go everywhere. But it's got the same, it's got a similar smell to the other one. Very candy scent. Like it's got a, like a candy scent to it. Um, the ingredients are in this little pack in the bottom and uh, thankfully no avocado oil or anything else. Um, there is macadamia oil in it and I don't know if I'm allergic to macadamia oil. I have quite a few allergies, but so far so good, no reactions uh, from this product line. I guess I didn't read the directions completely. It says to define curls or set braids, twist, coils or knots, apply a small amount to clean damp hair, let hair dry or you air dry or use a diffuser once fully dry, style at desired. For a smooth look, apply to dry, straight hair. Great for updos, ponytails, molding, or sculpting. Um, and it promises that it's perfect for curly or straight hair. Super long-lasting curls, waves, or twists. Non-greasy, non-drying, anti-shrinkage, non-flaking uh, product. Um, and that it will not leave hair greasy, sticky, or crunchy. Let's just be honest, every styler is going to put a little bit of crunch in your hair. And with this one, yeah, it's still pretty crunchy. Even after I tried to break the gel cast, it's crunchy. Um, 
I know the product is called Lotta Body and I feel like there's movement, but my hair's very flat. And usually first day hair is flat anyway. But I can't stand how flat it is. Like, ugh. I'm gonna just keep playing with it, but that'll like make it all frizzy and then it won't last. So hopefully day two will be a nicer shape to my hair. Because I, I'm really, I'm all about that big hair life. This product, I will look up the price to see how much this is and where you can find it. Never used it before. Um, of all the stylers I've tried, this is probably my least favorite. The smell doesn't bother me. I mean, it does linger. So if you're someone who doesn't like smells lingering, this smells. Uh, my hair still smells like these products. And it's not bothering me yet. And I'm hoping that it'll kind of dissipate as the days go on. I think it's a good size. If you were gonna do it with twists or bantu knots or something, you'd probably use less product. And in hindsight, I probably should have used less product than I did in the demo. I, I was like basically shingling my hair and I think I just needed to use less. So yeah, and you can't tell on camera right now, but there's flaking flakes all around the edge here and in the back. I think I got some good curl elongation and definitely got some good definition and that made me happy and shine. Like I don't have that bright light in my face. This is just a window behind the camera, so that's kind of nice that it's shiny. I like shiny hair. Um, and every time I touch it, my hair, my hands kind of feel a little tacky. I don't know if that means the my hair's not completely dry or if it's just the product wears off on your hands. Would I buy this if I were ever looking for a styler? I don't think I would buy this. It didn't wow me. And the fact that it flaked after putting this on, like, no. I feel like the two products from the same line should work well together and they didn't. This gave me, like I could already tell when I was putting this in, my hair was like super moisturized and soft. And I wonder what would have happened if I just let my hair air dry with just the moisture milk. Like, I wonder if it would turn out differently. Would I still get the definition and the crunch? Like, I don't know. Because I, try, I paired them together, it's hard to tell but the beading and the flaking only came when I used the custard jelly. So that's why I think this is the culprit. Having never used their products before, like I, I don't know, I didn't know what to expect. I don't think they're that expensive. And it's interesting that they're for relaxed and natural hair, especially because they're water-based. Because um, if you don't relax your hair bones straight, then I feel like it would kind of make your hair kind of wavy. Um, so sadly, I don't know how you would use this if you were relaxed. If you were transitioning, I think it would work really well with moisturizing. This product might work better for like a perm rod set or a twist out, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna try it though just because I didn't like the flaking reaction. Like if, if I try a set like that, I might try using the wrap mousse because I did a twist out. I didn't record a video because it was kind of like a last minute, I wanna try this, but I used a setting lotion and it actually turned out pretty nice. Granted, it only lasted one and a half days, but I'm learning, I'm learning. I'm, I don't know about that twist out life yet. I, I'm not good at it. <laughs> anyway, I'll stop rambling. I've got lots of goodies to review, so there's gonna be more videos coming. I'm sorry it's been a little while since I've posted something, but um, I wanna get back in the groove of things and making videos. I'm almost at 5,000 subscribers. That's awesome. And if I get to 5,000, I wanna do a giveaway. So a couple products that really helped me when I was transitioning. So it's kind of like a transitioning hair giveaway, but not really, like these will work for curly hair, natural hair. So when I get, if and when I get to 5,000 subscribers, I wanna do a giveaway and it'll be awesome because I've never done a giveaway before. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and for tuning in and for subscribing to my videos. If you have any questions or anything, uh, check the description box for all the details and leave a comment below. And until next time, bye.